Hey Junkies, welcome back to my channel. So today's video is a really, really exciting video and I'm going to be showing you what's in my travel makeup bag because your girl is going on holiday and I thought I would show you everything I'm packed and like the logic behind it and show you the best makeup bag in the world so if you are new around here I'm Makeup Junkie G and it would be amazing if you could subscribe and join the Junkie family hashtag I'm a Junkie don't forget to hit the notification bell button as that will just notify you every time I upload mostly recently my videos have not been going in subscription boxes so it'd be really important if you could just switch the notification button on and you'll never miss a video. Also, don't forget to stick around to the end of this video because I'm also going to be doing a giveaway. And I'm so excited to do my first ever giveaway. So let's quit the rambling. Let's get on into my makeup bag. So this is my makeup bag right here that I take away with me. This is so fab and like, listen to that. Very strong. This is by a company called Hobby and this is an amazing makeup bag. I will link everything down below because you guys need to check this out. This one right here um, is super good because it's really sturdy and that's what I like in a makeup bag. You're not good, it's not flimsy, it's very sturdy. I love that about it. And it's wearable material, it's flax, it looks very posh. And it's really good if you're a makeup artist on the go and you don't need that much. Your girl has got you covered. I'm going to get straight into it and show you what's inside because this is the best bit. I will be doing cutaways of this makeup bag just so you can see how I have organised this and how fab this design is. So when you open it up you've got two sides to it. So this side has got like compartments, there's a mirror and then this side here is got like where I can store my makeup brushes and also little niggy, niggly little bits. On one side of the makeup bag it has a flap which is so good because this little bit has got a mirror on it so it's perfect for on the plane or on the go and need to touch up your makeup you have a mirror there. Then we have like another flap which is so good because it's a mesh compartment. This is so fab for beauty blenders. Now if you have a beauty blender at home you will know that it has to be in mesh so it can breathe and dry out which is perfect. So this is where I store my beauty blender. Now I always set my beauty blender on holiday. It is a multi-use product. You can use it for your foundation, concealer, bronzer, one eternity later, highlighter, primer, pretty much everything. So I'm going to bring this and this is in this little mesh compartment here which fits so perfectly and really easy to get. Where would I be without cotton buds? I can't leave home without cotton buds. So this is like a selection that I've put in a bobble just because it keeps them all together. I love cotton buds because it helps smudge things out, you can clean your eye makeup, you can take mascara off with it, you also can just have them for nail polish, you know what I'm saying, so it's good to have cotton buds and these sit in with my beauty blender in the mesh compartment because it's just easy to get and when I need to quickly blend something out, touch up or take away mistakes these two are in the mesh compartment. I also would have in there like a lip balm or maybe some face cream, which I haven't got yet, but I will be having face cream in there in a little tub. So that would be in there just because it's something that you really need and it's essential. It's easy and quick to get. And that just sits up really easily and you can see clearly what's there and it's just so far. Then under that compartment, you lift that up then is where you can store all of your brushes that you're bringing on holiday, which is so amazing. So this section, I have all of my brushes that I need. So the first brush I have in here is this one. This is the Royal Lang Nickel Motor Brush. This is the contour brush, but I use this for foundation. I have a beauty blender, but I do like having a foundation brush just as another way of applying my foundation. I do love how I brush applies it. Then I have this brush here. So this here is the Zoeva 105 Lux Highlight Brush. I take this with me because I can use this for powder and bronzer. It's a really good tapered fluffy brush which you can set like your areas you need to mattify but you can also bronze up your skin like this. So this is like a two in one brush. Oh you just popped out there. Excuse me. Then in this section I have like my base like my 
concealer, highlight and bronzer. So this is my cream bronzer brush. This is my concealer brush and this is my highlighting brush. This is the Kika brush, a Spectrum brush and the good old Morphe brush. Then in this section of the brush part, I have my eyebrow brush from Peaches and Creams, my big fluffy blending brush, and then another one, which is just good to set under your eyes very lightly or dust away any little flaky mess. Then in the very last bit of the brush part, I have three eyeshadow brushes. I feel like you don't really need that many eyeshadow brushes, as long as you've got a good flute. As long as you've got a good few blending brushes, you are all ready to go. So I have an Urban Decay double um, sided brush. This is like a shader end and this is a good pencil brush. So it's a two in one brush really, I don't have to bring a pencil brush as well. So this is good for blending, smudging out. This is my Real Techniques fluffy brush. I love this for blending all over the lid and crease. And then another Zoeva brush. This is a 227 brush. I love using this for blending eyeshadows. Just everything about it. Your crease, your eyelid, your under eye. Now, just where the brushes are, there's another zip compartment. Every part of this makeup bag is storage, which I think is so, so good. All of my palettes and eyeshadows, everything like that, have been in one area. And when I rummage around, that's when things smash or get lost. So this makeup bag has different compartments where you can store your products. And it's so much easier for when you're doing your makeup because you can clearly see everything in front of you. And that, to me, is genius. So just where the brushes are, there's a zip compartment. And in the zip compartment, I have stored a palette in here. I like storing palettes in here because it's the perfect size and width. It's just bomb for palettes. Like, oh, I love it. So in this section here is my Modern Renaissance palette from ABH. I love this palette. And I think as long as you've got one good palette to go on holiday, this is it. And this is what I'm bringing on holiday. And I love bringing it because it's got warm shades. It's got gorgeous pinks in it, gorgeous oranges, some shimmers, you're pretty much set to go. This is the perfect summer palette and you can really go smoky with it as well. I bring one palette, one palette does all and it just doesn't get damaged because it's full of padding and your makeup will not smash or be wrecked. <laughs> and there it is, just slots in there so easy. Then moving on to the main compartment of the makeup bag, this is the most coolest makeup bag ever because this has sections it's not one big area filled with makeup i have divided this into sections you could have any sections of this you could have like one big middle section so you've just got two or you could do what i've done which is have three little compartments but you can bend them in any way you could literally design what works for you and your makeup and i love that about it so for me i have divided mine into four sections so at the top corner I have got my base, so I've got with me my MAC Studio Fix Foundation but I do love bringing it and mixing it with a moisturiser if I'm going out at night or in the day I just use concealers which I have clearly bought a lot of. I've bought my Collection Last Infection Concealer in the shade Lemon. I've also bought my Maybelline Anti-Age Rewind Concealer. This is slightly darker than my skin tone so when I'm on holiday and I've got a tan this will match perfectly. So I've got this one for the start of the holiday, then obviously when I get a tan, this is what I'll be cracking out. And I also can use this on my face during the day, and then at night I can use my foundation. And then of course I have my Maybelline Fit Me, which is the darker shade for bronzer and contouring. Then in the section next to it at the top, is where I keep my powders, my highlighters and my bronzer. I have brought one powder with me in case I do want to set my face because when it's really hot sometimes you can get really oily and I think it is good to have a powder. This is my MAC Mineralized Skin Finish. I love this because of how lightweight this is. It does give you a lovely glow to the skin and also you can use this as a light foundation. So once you apply your concealer, you could buff this into your skin and it gives you just that little bit of coverage, which is the reason I am bringing it because I could wear this on its own with concealer in the day. Then I have, of course, my highlighter. I love my highlighter on holiday, the Balm Mary Luminizer. I'm running out of this, so I just thought to bring it because I'll probably use it all up on holiday and it just blends so nicely on my skin 
and I really love this. You know how much I love this. I have got a powder bronzer. This is in case I do use powder products. I've got my powder bronzer, which is also I can use this for eyeshadow and contour. So it's a bronzer, contour, and eyeshadow in one, and I do love this so much. Last product in this section is my highlighting fluid from Urban Decay. I have to bring this on holiday. Even when I'm not wearing makeup, I can add this onto my skin to give me that gorgeous glow. And this is just beautiful for holiday, like holiday vibes. Then in the bottom section, so the first section, is basically my eyes. So I've added like my mascara and things that I need for the eyeballs. So I've added a pair of lashes. Now, I wouldn't wear lashes on holiday, but I've bought a little pack just in case. These are more lightweight, so I have bought the peaches and cream ones in the shade. In the shade? In the style 19. This is so lovely to wear and very easy to apply on holiday. I do have eyelash glue with me, of course, to apply lashes. And this is also fab to apply gems with. Then I've got two eyeliners. I've added a winged liner and a coal liner just because I like adding this to my tight line just to, be, to make my eyelashes thicker when I'm just wearing mascara but I've also added liner if I just wanted to add a little bit of like a liner when I've just got freckles I think it would look so pretty on holiday this is the Primark one which is my favourite eyeliner at the moment and then my Soap and Glory Coal Liner then of course I have my ABH Dip Brow Pomade for my eyebrows because your girl has to have her eyebrows doesn't matter where she is she has her eyebrow game strong. Then I have a mini mascara. This is the Urban Decay Perversion Mascara. It's perfect to have a mini on holiday because you're not going to use a full size. So this mini is so cute. Then the last thing I have in this section is the NYX Jumbo Eye Pencil in the shade Bronze. Just to add onto my eyes and then blend it in and you are done. It's such a beautiful colour and it's like a summer, de summer day. It's like the perfect holiday eyes i love it then in the last section of this bag i have like my lip products and then i've got some gems so i like bringing gems on holiday if we're going out for a meal or it's going to be a little bit more dressy i love adding gems to my face it's so pretty and it can really like add to your makeup just adding two gems here it looks beautiful so i have got this if i want to make more of an effort at night if we're going for cocktails on the beach can't beat a cocktail then i of course got two lip glosses these are my go-to holiday summer lip glosses of course my fenty beauty fenty glow lip gloss i love this and then my skinny dip um, lip topper from jue i love this and again gloss is so lovely to wear on holiday with like no makeup on or just highlighter it is beautiful the two lipsticks I have in here are both from MAC. I have a gorgeous bright red, which is perfect for holiday. Just having like a bright red lip and lashes on holiday with like big sunglasses. You can't leave home without a red lip. I know I can't. Then I of course have a nude, just in case I want to go a bit smoky at the night. Nude is good to have. This is Flesh Pot and this is Hooray for Holiday, which is very good. Like that name, like... Hooray for holiday. Oh my god, I'm going on holiday. What a cool thing. What I love about these compartments is each section is really padded. If your makeup does move around during travelling, your makeup isn't going to get smashed. It's all padded and cushioning. And the handle of this makeup bag is padded, so your hands aren't going to be in pain carrying this thing. And I feel so professional with it. Like, look at me in my professional makeup bag. I love it. That everything for my makeup bag so for my notification shout outs this week goes to Mia Moffat and Jelly Womack I am so so in love with your comments I love them very much thank you so much for all of your amazing support and comments I love you and now it's time for the giveaway which I'm super super excited to announce so I will be giving away two of these makeup bags because you guys are amazing and I think you would love this makeup bag. You could have this on your desk. This could be your everyday makeup bag instead of having a vanity. And I thought I would give away two of these incredible makeup bags to two of my amazing subscribers. So this giveaway is international for my international viewers and my subscribers. I love you very much. And you guys deserve a chance too. And all you have to do is... 
be subscribed on my channel of course and you have to have the notification bell button on I do check that so you can't get away with that my third rule is you have to follow me on my Instagram and it's makeup junkie G that's all it is then comment down below why you would love this makeup bag and then at the end of your comment you've got to put your Instagram handle just because it's an easier way for me to contact you so if you put your Instagram handle in your comment I can contact you and say you're the winner so that is it all of the rules will be down in the description box definitely double check that tell your friends get everyone to watch this video and make sure you enter and just follow the rules that's all I'm asking and good luck. I really, really love you so much. I hope you enjoy this little giveaway. So this giveaway ends on the 17th of June. And make sure, again, you comment down below. I can see your comment and your Instagram handle. Good luck, and I love you so much. And I'm going to love you and leave you now. And I will see you on Sunday for a brand new main channel video. Bye. Mwah.